spectacles, a pocket knife, and Confederate cash. Clark, I've been lucky enough to see a number of incredible objects here at the Library of Congress. This collection blows me away. Tell us what we're looking at right here. What we have here are the contents of President Lincoln's pockets for the night of his assassination at Ford's Theater, April the 14th, 1865. These are the actual things that were in the man's pockets when he was assassinated. Yes, yes. Absolutely incredible. Mm -hmm. Let's talk through what, what these objects are one by one. First of all, he had a, a, a linen handkerchief, uh, by the way, with A. Lincoln stenciled in red. He was carrying two pairs of glasses that two night. Two pairs of glasses. Yes. This larger pair, which, by the way, has a string repair at the bow. That was put there by Mr. Lincoln himself. And he had a small folding pair of glasses as well on his person. And he had a pocket knife that evening. It's a multi-blade. There's actually six blades on this pocket knife. It, it's um, silver and, of course, has a, an ivory casing. And a watch fob. Of course, in those days, no wristwatch for men. You had uh, a pocket watch. Right. And, uh, of course, this would be attached to a chain and then in, in, in also, of course, to his watch. Uh, it's, it's made of quartz with, with gold encasing. The only money on his person that evening, Jamie, was a Confederate $5 bill. He had no union money on his person. Abraham Lincoln was carrying a Confederate fiver. Yes. What can possibly be the reason for that? Well, we don't know with 100% certainty, but just a few days earlier, Richmond had fallen. And Lincoln did actually travel to Richmond. And uh, this was likely passed on to him as a souvenir. Some kind of souvenir of the fall of Richmond. Precisely. You know, we've looked at a number of different uh, Lincoln objects here in our visit. And throughout, I'm struck most of all by how unspecial they are in a way. They're really very everyday. They're, they're just what a normal man would have in his pocket. And invariably, the most favorite of all objects within the library's collections are the contents of Mr. Lincoln's pockets. It's, it's really very touching in its way. In, indeed. Clark Evans, Head of Reference Services in the Rare Book and Special Collections Division, Library of Congress.